Good morning, and welcome to Bible Practice. My name's Mike. I've said hello to Josh, and my brother Anthony in Providence, and uh, Claudia, Pat, Karen out in Connecticut, um, and all the others that listen. Um, have a great day. Stay with Jesus. Profess his name everywhere you go. Look at all the opportunities he gives you to do that. And uh, he will. My uh, cold's still hanging on a little bit here, but it's getting better. I played last night. I made it through the night. Thank you, Jesus. Um, but uh, I'll see if I can get through today. But I'll get through today anyway because he's going to get me through today. Whether I play or I don't play, he's still with me. And uh, he's helping me, and he's designed this whole day for me. So whatever happens today came from him. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. All right, here's some inspiration for us today. And listen to the words. This is great stuff here. It's all great, but some, some are a little more great than others that I find anyway. And the words say this. I am calling you to a life of thankfulness. Always talks about thankfulness. We have to be thankful. I want all your moments to be punctuated with thankfulness. It's Thanksgiving. The basis for your gratitude is my sovereignty. I am the creator and controller of the universe. Heaven and earth are filled with my glorious presence. When you criticize or complain, you are acting as if you think you could run the world better than I do. So true. Huh? From your limited human perspective, it may look as if I am mismanaging things, but you don't know what I know or see what I see. If I pulled back the curtain to allow you to view heavenly realms, you would understand much more. However, I have designed you to live by faith, not by sight. I lovingly shield you from knowing the future or seeing into the spirit world. Acknowledge my sovereignty by giving thanks in all circumstances. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. And Bible support for these words come from Isaiah 6. Verses 3, uh, 2 Corinthians 5, verses 7, and 1 Thessalonians 5, verse 18. You can read those passages and you should read them. And um, they'll inspire these words. They inspired these words in person. Let's see what the Lord inspires you in those passages. Again, the passage is Isaiah 6, verse 3. 2 Corinthians 5, verse 7, and 1 Thessalonians 5, verse 18. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Well, it's another, looks like a nice day out there. And uh, most people, my wife, she goes right to the TV and gets a weather report. I just look out the window and say, thank you, Jesus. Sunny today. Oh, good. And uh, you can see the Beginning of spring, flowers are starting to come up from the ground and trees blossoming, starting to blossom and uh, air is getting a little warmer. Even once in a while, we have a little snow in there. That's okay. Um, it's, uh, it's all designed by him. Thank you, Jesus. Way beyond our minds, we can't conceive it. We can only fantasize. <laughs> And that's not, he's the only truth. What we think is all fantasy. Unless we're reading the Bible and then that's telling us the truth. We don't always understand it. But uh, that's okay too. As long as we give thanks for it. It's okay with him. I, it's what he tells us anyway. And um, I believe him so. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, heaven. Thank you, all the saints. Thank you, everyone up there with, with the Lord Jesus and Father. And all right. Don't forget to sing happy birthday to Jesus today. 
Okay. I already did it. I'm going to do it again. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Jesus. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Lord. And you never know what day. No one does. The world celebrates it on the 25th of December. Nobody really knows the day it was born. So sing it every day, and you will have sung it on this actual birthday. You won't even know if it's the actual, you know, when it actually was. But he'll know. He loves you to take the time to do that. I know that. <laughs> That's part of the thankfulness. Being thankful to him. Praise God. Have a great day, everybody. Love you. Peace. Bye-bye.